Now they will. Yeah, that's my own face, Bobby. I know we were expecting Damage. some new development. Yeah. This is what's gonna be in Avon Esports as well, so I'm gonna keep it to that. It's to come through. But some of them have failed quality control. We'll need to tell the team what to redevelop via the R and D screen. Wait, what 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 was broken? What didn't went through? Oh bolt! No. What a disaster. Uh, powertrain is maxed at the moment. Actually, we can do one more. Fuel flow regulator, but we don't have enough resource points. And it's not that important anyway as well. With those chassis and arrow upgrades, we will jump ahead of Alpha Tari, I think so. But they failed. Which is not ideal. So now it's another weekend of pain in Monza. Though so our internal combustion upgrades did went through, just the downforce one. Which we really needed, then it went through. We can't use that IC anymore. We can use the second one, the first one for the kinetic generator units. And the first one for control electronics. It should be good enough for FP1. Race strategy. So over that one. Fields. No idea. Then we have to wait for next session. Uh, let's finish the race strategy. Race strategy is finished now. Tire management up next. I know eBay boy. I know it increases the wear on components a lot, but. The practice programs get boring to watch as well, you know, and to do. Decent point gain, 1400. GG's. Alright, that's first turbocharger's finished. Let's put the third one in. Third one in. Energy store, second one, first motor generator unit is finished as well. Let's go for the second one for the kinetic and third internal combustion engine. We are... We need a new practice gearbox actually, but that's all we done for next weekend. Um, I don't expect to get into Q2 on mediums, but I think I'm going to do some laps on mediums at least. Alright, let's do two push laps on the mediums. And then move on to the softs, where I can do two push laps as well. Do we have R&D on default or decreased? I've got everything on default. I didn't touch that. Imagine if we make it into Q2 on mediums. I doubt it, but will be cool. Engine is carrying us into turn one. It's not going well. Seven times down to Swatchman. Actually, that's not too bad on the medium. I think so. I knew I knew I was gonna be too slow on the medium skills. That's a nice consistent cut tire too. Do a little bit of warm up on. I think we're gonna be a second down. 
Yeah. Let's go for two laps on the softs as well. I do, John. Interesting. I swear I took that last lap the exact same and it then it went flying into the air. That really needs fixing, that's ridiculous. There's no way we can drive esports with that. Well, all in the second lap then, because this is not enough, because of that incident in the second chicken. But how do I know it's not going to jump up this time around? It's, it's going to be random. Oh, well, it didn't. This car is horrible, it is. Not enough. It's not enough, B20. No. Yeah, true, John. That's a small issue as well. Ferrari P1, P2 and Monza. Okay. Okay, okay. Swatchman went into Q2 and we didn't. Not ideal. Worst. Good day today. Let's have a Fuck you. Fun. You won't be starting at the front of the pack. Are you worried? No comment. How do you think this team will be feeling after that result? Yeah. Uh, Yeah, maybe if it didn't fail that arrow update, who would it have been that one? Thank you, Foot Gueza, for the sub. Anyways, let's just take red penalties. Because it doesn't matter if we start P20 or P22 anyway. Thank you, Tino, for the sub, mate. Fries or chips? Welcome Fries. back to one of only two countries that has held a race every year since the very first Formula One World Championship in 1950. It is, of course, Italy, one of the great racing nations. And it's time to get underway for the Italian Grand Prix. With top speeds up to 215 miles per hour and an average lap speed of around 155 miles per hour, Monza's reputation as one of the fastest circuits in the sport is well earned. We have 11 corners on this 3.6 yes, track, on. with the best overtaking chance coming into the heavy braking zone of the Turn 1 chicane. 
Anthony Davidson joins me once again in the commentary box, and it's fantastic to have you with us here today. But I'm curious, as a man with experience out on the track, how do you stop those pre-race nerves from becoming overwhelming when you're lining up on the grid? But from the moment qualifying's over, you start to feel the adrenaline in your body build up and the buzz in your stomach as you anticipate the rundown into Turn 1. It's all a bit like going into battle, and the unknown situation makes you nervous. Those pre-race nerves are a good thing. The day you don't have them means that you don't care anymore. And of course, you have to make sure that all the procedures are second nature to you, so that they're not taking up too much of your capacity. With the race minutes away from starting, here's what today's grid rundown looks like. An immense lap from Lewis Hamilton yesterday puts him on pole position, and it's Valtteri Bottas that completes the front row. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Ricardo, Norris, Max Verstappen and Stroll, Vettel, Perez, Leclerc and Carlos Sainz, Gasly, Sonoda, Kimi Raikkonen and Russell, Giovinazzi, Mazepin, the Lone Lambert and Mick Schumacher, Latifi, Fernando Alonso, Ocon. They'll be starting further back after an earlier grid penalty. Thank you, Hestelbad, for the sub, mate. And now it's time to head down to the track. Well, let's go. Bokmer Academy starting last and second last. Alpine down bad. I think they might have taken grid penalty. How, how does it say I'm starting P17? It's a bit interesting. F1 Esports was scripted. I swear there were people at some point that thought F1 Esports was scripted because of the pre. Um, the ra some races were pre recorded, you know? Because otherwise we have to drive for like five hours straight. How far ahead of YouTube is this? Five or six races, I think so. Terrible start on those mediums. Three white! Sheesh. People up ahead fighting. One Mercedes car has absolutely dropped everyone already. I've got no ERS for the rest of the lap almost. We have to get a DRS in two laps time. Oh, this is not good. I've used too much. Oh, virtual safety car. Why is there a virtual safety car, by the way? I think just damage from someone, probably. Oh, that was such a shit ending.
lizard on the track. Go away, Alonso. Okay. Everyone is here as a part for me. Thank you, hey, our vets for the sub, mate. I'm low on heroes again. Oh, please don't destroy me. I still have a family. Oh, they're going. Three wide up front. Oh, Alonso going for it and Russell. Give me slipstream, Fernando. We need it. One issue we have is we can keep up with the Alfa Romeos, but the front Alfa Romeo is P12. So that's not ideal. Oh, Mazepin, no dearest for the first time. Don't go defensive, just stay in straight. Nice, now I can overtake you in the main straight. I swear it felt easier to get points at the start of the season than now. I think we've gone backwards with development. Alonso pits. I'm gonna stop people pit. Oh, there comes Valtteri. Absolute miles ahead of Hamilton. Well, actually, not that much. We're just slow. Hamilton has just caught up that much. We're using our overtake button, and he's still gaining time on the straight. Probably take the heroes on the main straight from him. If we don't lose too much time. Have DRS. No chance. I had no chance. 
If I'm really close into the second chicane, I might be able to get the arrest towards Ascari again. Although I doubt it. I even took a warning to try and get it. Oh my god, they're pulling away so much. Here comes Ricardo. He was enabled. I might as well let him go. Too slow anyway. <sighs> Mama mia. Understood, stopping this lap. That's box. Points is looking very unlikely. We're already P12, we still need to make our pit stop. Ah, it's so annoying. Why do you use KPH and not miles per hour? Because KPH is like way more precise. to uh, jinx anything, but two DNFs in the top 10 will be f nice now. P11 dream. I swear, if I overtake Alonso and one person only DNFs, man. I'm gonna cry. Alright, the battle for the fastest lap is on then again. Will be way harder here. Hell no. To get fastest lap on Monza is way easier. Look how close we were. I wasn't even pushing on that 19 far. I think you can catch the castle? No, I don't think so.
you just throw straight into it? Are we gonna penalty? Oh my god. Ay, caramba. I think indeed we should retire and save the components. She does some damage, yeah, I've got rear wing damage. Retire the car. Confirmed, we'll receive you at the end of this lap. Actually, yeah, that's the best thing to do. P0, P0, slow button on. Actually, it's the other way around. Even if you put a rocket ship, we will be P11. Yeah. 